and we're going to be watching those scattered downpours and storms tonight into the pre dawn hours. Our second headline. This is just a little blip in the road because the next three days are going to be spectacular to be outdoors as we end the month of May, go into the beginning of June, and then it turns warmer more sticky as we get into early next week with temperatures back in the 80s and that humidity coming back up. Storm Tracker 6 live quiet in the Delaware Valley all the way down to the shore. We have one lightning strike now coming out of a cell south of Dover. Also back to our west here in Lancaster County. There's just a downpour to the south and eastern part of Lancaster County working its way over the border into Chester County and quite a lightning storm here. Not severe, but that's working right into the western part of Lancaster County and this will continue to overspread from the west to the east as we get throughout your evening and early overnight hours. It's a big feature. Now you're looking at the radar. You're seeing that it's not a big area of green everywhere. It's spotty in nature, so some areas this evening got not getting anything. Other areas you may get hit two, three times as the progression of that upper level low comes through. This is six o'clock this evening, seeing some of that action working up towards the Lehigh Valley, also down towards the shore with more trying to fire up back to the west as we get towards mid evening, nine o'clock. Still some action in the southern areas trying to dry out to the north and west by that point in time as most of the potent energy working with again the heating of the day. What's we're losing sunset by that time. We'll start to quiet down 2 o'clock in the morning, not looking bad. 8 a.m. tomorrow morning, you drive back to work and school. Northwesterly wind, there are the clouds starting to push away, and really a nice day overall. 77 in the city, that is perfect for this time of year. 76 Millville, Seabreeze at the shore, 66 Seattle City, Long Beach Island in the upper 60s. So the sky tomorrow looking really great. Sunny, breezy, comfortable. We have a healthy wind, 8 to 16. We're looking at mid 70s everywhere, even at the shore because of that land breeze. The exclusive Acura with a 7 day forecast, partly sunny, 75 tomorrow, that isolated showers early and it's far to the east. Sunny and crisp. Love it. Last day. Actually, that's the first day of June 76 Friday bright. No, that's the last day of May. I'm jumping the gun. June is Saturday, 82 degrees. If you're heading to the Phillies game, the union looks really nice. More clouds and sun on Sunday, 84 degrees, and then it starts to turn more humid as we get into the early part of next week. Very summer like temperatures mid to the upper 80s and with more humidity being introduced, you get those stray typical pop-ups around here. So if you have a ticket to the game early next week, you may get hit or dodge some of those drops. Uh, Sarah will have another update coming up in the next half hour. All right.